So we're here in Boston, and we're actually following the Freedom Trail today, which is right in front of me. The famous story that goes with this building actually involves the Boston Tea Party. In this room, legend has it, George Washington interrogated two British soldiers. Really, we're standing in the room where it all began. The one if by land, two if by sea part actually refers to Old North Church here in Boston. Now that's pretty amazing. They come onto these ships, three ships total, Robert Newman and John Poling basically held lanterns here, signaling to the men that they had to get ready. Both sides knew the importance of this property. This is the high ground. This is a musket that was found at Bunker Hill at the site. There are places where you can kind of feel things, and this is one of those places. You're going to have 5,000 people meet for a meeting. We're standing in front of John Adams' birthplace. Over 90,000 pounds of tea are dumped in the harbor. He then reads the Declaration of Independence to the crowd below. And so the guys that were working here, I wondered to myself, do they know that? Did they ever realize how big this was actually gonna become? So here we are on the deck of the Eleanor and we're ready to destroy some tea. Some people have called Boston the birthplace of the American Revolution. From Bunker Hill to Dorchester Heights to Paul Revere's home, and to the Old North Church. Boston is full of American history adventure. So join me as we go through Boston to these American historical sites and really start capturing the emotion behind the American Revolution. Let's go.